Yo, what's up, Elite Fam? Charles Macro here today, jumping back in the fishing planet. Hope everybody doing well. Shout out to you and yours, man. Thank you for stopping through. We're going to get into this stream. Yo. What's going on, everybody? How y'all doing? Can y'all hear me out there? Can y'all hear me out there? Let me know if y'all can hear me all right. Let's see who up in here. What's up, Jaden? What's up, Carter? Wolf boy, what's going on? What's going on? How y'all doing? What's up, subs? What up, what up? Yeah, California's still good money, man. I was out there not too long ago. What's up, Trey? What's going on? What's going on? Yeah, California is still good money on those sturgeons. Now the XP for the uh for the money, the XP is not good, but it's still good money, man. If you're just trying to get money, it's a great grind. It's great money. So yeah, guys, we at Blue Crab. Let me let you know we at Blue Crab. I'm still at Blue Crab. I've been grinding, trying to get my money up. And um it's good money. Blue Crab, Blue Crab is one of the like the newer lakes that they released. Weeping Willow, Blue Crab, uh the Mahi Mahi joint, Amazon. All of those lakes appear to be really good money. A lot of big fish that um you could catch, you know, some 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 lunkers. And they got good money, good XP. So these drum right here, the tarpon, all of them have been good money. Since we streamed yesterday, I've been practicing some of the stuff y'all showed me, man. And um, yeah, really been finding some good, good money makers, testing out some uh spin, testing out some bait. I hit level 55. I hit level 55, so it opened up some more bait. Let's see, this one like it's going. So one of the bait that I've been using, guys, is crab. A lot of people recommended crab. I am not, uh, I'm not big on crab because I keep getting these these pompets, whatever them joints is called. Hold on, we'll see. I just started a new day, and yeah, the permit. I keep getting permit. I get a few uh, drum every now and then. But man, it's been like all permit. The large cut bait was getting me the best and the minnows. And I actually ran out of those. I had about a hundred when I got here. And I've already ran out of minnows. So I've been using crab. I tried uh try one other bait I'll show y'all. But what I'm trying to do is just run out these crabs. And once I run out, they don't sell large minnows or large cut bait here. I got medium cut bait. Medium cut bait works too. And I got shiners. Shiners work. And then they got this fish here that's like a bigger shiner and the Gulf shrimp. I've been using those Gulf shrimp. Now, the Gulf shrimp do good money. Look, here we go. We got a drum right here. Trophy red drum, though. I mean, hey, that's pretty nice, though. That's pretty nice. So, yeah, I got crab on all four of these. I'm going to go ahead and do the 30-day here, so... The next few streams going to probably be from Blue Crab, but I am going to move around. Probably in the next one, I'm going to do the exploration because, um, you know, that exploration, the Golden Shiner, the Warmouth, Oscar, Brown Bullhead, Red Air Sunfish. It was one more fish, but I already caught it. I'm going to probably go in a probably next stream. I do that. And just try to knock off as many days as I can. And I got to stack up a lot of money because the last 30 day challenge I did at San Joe Quine, it cost me about 200K in repairs. And so I ain't trying to go through that again. So I've made about 200K in 10 days here. Um, That's minus the license fee and minus the 2,500 per day. Let's see, 10 times. I've spent 25,000 in the day charges. So I probably made it almost. 300k 250 300 but yeah them fees be adding up but yeah man how y'all doing what's going on subs you say uh you at almost the same spot great minds think alike yeah that's right that's right absolutely 
Absolutely. I actually went over to the barge and tested over there. Uh, somebody was telling me about the barge yesterday, but I don't know the exact spot, but I did catch a few fish. I got this major popper too. Now this major popper is actually really good for tarpon. I caught some really big tarpon using this. Didn't catch a uni, but you know, caught a lot of joints that was about 1,000, 1,500 in pay. Oh, look, this might be a hit right here. It's one chasing it. Hey, okay, that's a snook. That's a snook. See, you only using one ride? Yeah, that's smart. That's smart. I would only use one ride or even if you brought multiples, like I would probably come here and just use, uh, you know, the feeders because, yeah, <laughs> the cost got crazy repairing all those doggone rides. But the money is really good. I expect that if I do 30 days here, I'm going to have about 600, 700,000. So even if the repairs are like 200, I can deal with it. But I do definitely want to start taking some of my inventory out. So, you know, I don't have to spend that much money. Yeah, man. Say so you about to grill out, man. Uh, That's what's up. That's what's up. Yeah, it's a nice day today, man. It feels really good outside. I went out a bit. And um, I, I ain't do a lot out there, though. But it feels really good today. Great day to be outside, at least where I'm at. How's the weather where y'all at? And, man, I figured out, thank you. I'm not sure who it was yesterday, but thank you for telling me the technique to how to properly use the popper. It actually works with all top water lure. This technique works really well. I practiced it. I tried it with the frog. I tried it with the walker. It works with all top water lure. All right, we got a hit, guys. We might have two. Oh, sub, say you keep net broke. No, no, you can't let the keep net break. Say you in West Tennessee. That's what's up, Tennessee. My, I got an auntie in Tennessee. I'm in the Carolinas, man. Carolina. Let's see, 79 Sunday afternoon. Yeah, that's how it is, man. We right next door, so we got similar weather. 101, where you at, Trey? Woo! Yeah, that's hot. <laughs> that's hot. Do -do 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 -do. Hot. Let's see. If you're going to do 30 days in Blue Crab, just use one ride or at least one bottom ride. Yeah, again, if I'd have known, I'm going to try to go into it like the next one that I open up. Whatever the one that's after this. That opens up at like 58. You know, I probably uh try to be a little more intentional about the rides I bring. I don't like to throw away money, but it is what it is. There's a lot of good money at this place. A lot of good money at this place. Uh let's see. What's the top water secret? You miss a lot of fish on top. What's up, John Luke? Hold on, I'm gonna tell you, Carter. Uh, it's 12 at night here in South Africa. Ah, okay. Well, then it's probably a lot cooler than it is here. But I don't know. Y'all still might have good temperature, though. It still might be feeling good, feeling great. Okay, the top water secret is basically start reeling. Go down to reel speed one, you know, or two. See, this one of them permits right here, probably. But go down to reel speed one or two. Uh, and then just start reeling, right? Start reeling and then double pop. And then keep reeling the whole time and then double pop and then just reel. You don't have to pop anymore. And it'll say popping the whole time. I'm going to show you real quick. I'm going to show you. Give me one second as I reel this joint in. This thing through the trees. Shout out to everybody who uh, came through the other stream that just started. I my Now, I will admit, my streaming software was open. OBS was open. Because I use it to just capture when I'm playing other stuff. And so as I'm catching these big fish and stuff, I capture sometimes just for video purposes. But for whatever reason, it streamed. I don't know if I hit a hot key by mistake or what. But then it stopped. It only went seven seconds. So I got to start watching this program. I think it'd be activating on their own. I'm going to start thinking it's a conspiracy theory or something. And it's just activating. They pressing that button. They pressing that button. <laughs> But, yeah, man, I know a few of you guys came through uh, the other stream that started up, man. So, appreciate it. 
And hit that like button, guys. Hit that like button. Like, subscribe. Share if you uh share, you know, that help it get out, feed that algorithm. Follow if you on Twitch. Do all that good stuff. And do all that good stuff. Yeah, I'm doing good, John Luke. Doing pretty good. How about you? How about you? Let's see, it's 12 at night and it's hot. Oh. Hey, that's nice though. I, I'd rather it be warm or, or hot than cold. Let's see, you try to wait to sit the hook. Okay. Uh, you missed them setting the hook too early. Ah, uh, okay, okay. Uh completed head over heels mission. Yeah, yeah, I've completed that. I did that in the uh the kayak. Oh, there we go. Come on in. Come on in. I thought this was a permit, but this might not be. I can't see it. Come on in. Come on in. Uh, come on in. These permits, these trophy, they like little of fish, even though they got huge heads. But they um they give a good little fight. Is this a permit? Yeah, man. These trophy permits and these uni permits, they give a really good fight. All right, let's see which one of these we want to go for. But yeah, crab give me a lot of permit. Crab give me a lot of permit. So I'm I'm running out all this crab because I don't want permit. Cut bait has been getting me the most drum. All right, we're going to let that one go. All right, Carter. Hey, have a good one, man. Take it easy. Take it easy. Come on in. I need some drum. I need some drum. Yeah, see? Another permit. Another permit, man. I be trying to avoid these permits. But yeah, guys, and I ain't going to stream too long just to let you know. Again, I triggered the stream by mistake. I don't like pump faking. So I said, let me go on the stream for my people. But um, yeah, just going to do this for a little minute. Get in here and catch us some, and then I'm going to hop back off. And I might stream some more later, man. I got to, um, I need to play some more car mechanic. All right. Ah, that's trash. Y'all see that? That's trash. That's trash. Oh, nah. The LEDs, they've been back there. They ain't new, new. Yeah, they've been back there. Just always, they ain't show up well all the time. Let's see, best bass fishing quarter, 694, 697, 694, 697. Okay, let me get a picture of that. Dallas, what's up? So you aced the test on Friday. Nice, nice. Congrats, congrats. Okay, 694, 697. Yeah, don't they got like some huge trophy peacock bass here, subs? It's some huge trophy peacock bass here that you can get like over a thousand in earnings when you catch them. I did not know that. I thought they was like gonna be smaller, like uh, you know, some of your peacock bass you catch in the Everglades. They like huge. Oh yeah, man, the fish I was just reeling in was pulled in through these tree veins or whatever you want to call it, tree roots, and it, it hit the low line tension. It was right there in front of me, and it was like low line tension, man. So they got me. It's all gravy. It's all gravy. Say you on 2K, playing 2K Dallas. That's what's up. Uh, I actually got 2K up on my other uh, TV. I be running both. I've made a Charles Macro 2K channel. I still ain't putting no content, though, but I've been capturing content as I play. And I I'll, I'll fish at the same time. But I am going to put some content up. I might just do some streams. Uh, Dallas subs, man. Let's see. Yeah, let me know. Oh, yeah, you said some more than 2K? <laughs> I'm with you, subs. Look, Dallas said 2K had me going back and forth. But, yeah, you say some, you make more than 2K off those peacock bass. 
Yeah, man, it's real good money. Real good money. That'll be one of the things I do before I leave. I'll go fish bass, and I'm going to go do this exploration. I would do it today, but, yeah, I'm going to wait. The next one, I'll just do straight exploration. Right now, I'm still stacking this bread. Callers, what's going on, callers? I'm good, man. How you? How you? Hey, yeah, subs. I figured it out. <laughs> ah, doggone it. We had a hit. We had a hit. And I noticed that these crabs bring back a lot of permit. And when I filled my net up, I I was about three to five thousand less than what I would normally make when I catch more drum and even though drum ain't the best per pound, but they good though. It's real good, especially when you get those trophies and those unis. Unis come back with a lot of money. Callers, you say you can't figure out YouTube. So you sniped a medium MT bonus Colossal Dane for 12.5. Nice, nice. That's what's up. I done got a few decent snipes. I, I like sniping. So yeah, I work the market quite a bit. There we go. Joe, I'm good. What's going on with you, Joe? How you been? How you been? I'm good, man. Just chilling out. Catching some big ones. Trying to work this popper. Let the poppers pop and the breakers break. Let's see, you posted a hunting vid and got a channel strike. You didn't show anything graphics. Yeah, YouTube can be a little funky, man. You got to kind of figure out what the issue is. Did you play some music in your video? Because, yeah, it could be some music if you played any copyrighted music. I'm not sure why else they would do it other than that. Other than the uh, devs of, of a hunter... Striking people, but I don't. I never heard of them doing that. Uh, do I have large minnows on one hook? I don't think so. I don't think so. I believe I ran out of uh, minnows and large cut bait, but I got to check. I'll look when I pull these up. What's up, turkey? What's going on? What's going on? All right, we got one here. Black drum. Oh, they going off. They going off. Your first limit again, you got an error. Ah, dang. That stinks. Uh, my biggest strike bass? Ooh, I don't know. Not really big. Maybe 10 pounds. Oh, you said strike bass. The strike bass are at San Joe. I really got to look. I got to look. It might be 15, 20 pounds, but yeah, I have to look. Let's see, Jean-Luc, you playing Hunter, Call of the Wild. Okay. I hadn't got on Hunter in a minute. Yeah, these permit, man. If you use crab, at least for me, I get a lot of permit, guys. I was just saying that. Cut bait and even minnows get me way more than other ones. You still get permit, but you don't get them every time. Like, I get permit, like, every time throwing these. Um, Oh, you know what? Let me get my other rod out. I get permit, like, every time using crab, so I'm not buying any more crab. Maybe it's a different crab in the store, but the first one you get when you get the level 55, not good for me. Let 
Let's see, you got the day off. Fishing Planet today, need some time out. Hey, that's what's up, man. Enjoy it. Enjoy it. Yep, got another hit. Got another hit. Trying to see if anything jump on this before I pull it up. Let's see. You don't understand how you catching trophy common carts with dark muscle meat. Yeah, I don't get that either. But there are fish that catch things on uncommon bait for that fish. Now, sometimes they fix it. You know, they'll, they'll uh, update it later. For instance, the buffalo at Lone Star. You know, we used to be able to catch that with bread and honey, which isn't on their list at all. And I think they, they kind of nerfed it. You can catch it a little bit now, but the devs fixed it. But it took them like two years to fix it, you know. So they may fix catching carp with dark muscle meat, but it'll probably be in there for a while before they catch it. Uh, has the deep sea fishing update came out? No. Uh, let's see. There are striped bass there where I am. Oh, okay. No, nah, I hadn't caught any striped bass here. The only thing I've been catching here is drum, the red and black. Um, drum, the red and black, that permit. And it's one other fish that's on this crab island list. So yeah, those are really it. Oh, and snook. Y'all know snook always be right there. Let's see, dream fish to fish for in real life. Mm, I want to catch a barracuda. <laughs> I was on a boat where somebody caught one uh, one time, but I've never caught one. Dog, I almost had a hit. I almost had a hit. Let's see, yours is 20K striped bass, 55 pounds. Goodness. Yeah, the bass here are crazy. The striped bass, the peacock bass, they are humongous. I did not know they got like that here. Let's see, Wolf, your personal best in real life is 35. Wow. 50, so they get a lot bigger. They make them bigger in the game. Okay. Other side, turn around, best fishing spot. You talking about over here? Because I actually caught a trophy right there. But I threw rise out and didn't catch a lot of stuff, so I went back to that side. And I'm pretty sure you can catch more fish in here. I was like, you got to be able to catch it in more than this spot. This is just the spot everybody uses. But subs, you got to tell me where, though. You got to tell me where. Where do I need to cast to catch the fish? Oh, oh, I had a hit. I had a hit. Yeah, you got to let me know what direction I need to cast. To the left towards my boat, straight. To the right, you know what I mean? How far do I need to cast out? Is that still drum? Because I forgot. I got to pull out my map. I don't remember what I caught right there. I believe it was a drum, though, because I marked it. Let me see what I caught right there. I'm going to look on my map. Oh, it gets deep right there, too. Okay, yeah, I caught a trophy black drum on large cut bait. I'm going to cast one more time, then I'm going to head back over. Them rides probably going off. Oh, look, I hear them. I hear them. Ah, doggone it. I can't put the ride down. Let's see, more to the back. Okay. Woof. Let's see, you've been playing three days nonstop. Just thought to myself, gonna have to take a break. When you go back on, your fingers are hurting. <laughs> I hear you. Let's see, way back. Okay. All right, yeah, send me those coordinates. Let's get this here. Let's get this here. Here we go. I hope this ain't another permit. Because y'all gonna see what I mean, man. I catch like a ton of permit. All right, it's still pretty deep. So this one, yep, another permit, man. I'm tired of these joints. All right, there we go.
Hey, subs, the coordinates that you sent me a minute ago, I recorded them. Is that here? Is this right here in front of where I'm at? Or is it in a different location? Because I thought maybe it was uh, in a different location. I'll go ahead and cash to it or see if I got any extra markers. Uh, I thought I heard something. Okay. Oh, way top of the map. Okay. All right. All right. All right. All right, here we go. Well, we got a drum off this one. And he pulling. So it looked to be a big drum, guys. This one looked to be a big drum. Yeah. He don't even feel me pulling on him. Y'all know that's a trophy or a uni when they just swimming like ain't no hook in them. That's a trophy or a uni all day. Let me just let him sit right there. There we go. There we go. Look, they out there looking like Jaws. That fish out there looking like Jaws. I need a sound effect. They'd be like, do 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 I mean, look at this. Look at this. All right, come on, come on. Oh, you say you lose line faster when you reel while he running? Hey, what's up, P4? What's going on? What's up, Sleep? How y'all doing? How y'all doing? Welcome to the stream. We got a big one on the line. You right on time. This might be a uni. This might be a uni. I'm trying to rock him to sleep. Let's see. The game is fun when you get a lot of fish and have a lot of money and get to choose what you want to fish. Yeah, you right about that. Hey, Michael, what's up? What's up? What's going on? What's going on? How goes it? And yeah, that's kind of the trick to fishing planet. Like, we'll say the first five lakes, five to ten lakes, you can fish those and, you know, make a fair amount of money, and they don't cost a lot of money. You know, the licenses aren't too high. You know, you can fish them. Oh, this is a big drum. Let's see. Let's see. Is it a trophy or a uni? Trophy. Okay. It's good money. Good money. Good XP. Um, But it's once you start getting past those first five, we'll say five to eight lakes, because the expenses get crazy. And if you ain't got a lot of time to grind, what really eats you up more than anything is the licenses. That's one thing I don't like, but I understand the way that why they do it the way they do it. Everything else is based on game time, but they make the licenses based on real life, real world time. So if you go to a lake, you don't spend that travel money and you buy a license and say it's just 4K. Let's say something come up and you busy. You know, you like, all right, I'm going to sit here and fish for a while. Maybe fish for an hour, two if you got it. If something come up and you got to leave and you can't come back and play till tomorrow, your license expires. It would be fair if there's such thing as fair. Um, If the license expired in game time, you know what I'm saying? The same way your day game has its own time, the license will be the same. But I understand why they do it because they're trying to have a system to make sure you got to spend some money. You have to stay active. I get it. You know what I mean? But um, the licenses are what gets you. That's why the best way to enjoy the game if you get your bait coins is to use them on licenses because then you don't have to worry about that daily fee that's going to deduct from your profits each day. But, yeah, they definitely make you have to grind. <laughs> yeah, man. I don't know what happened sleep. Yeah, you know, that I told him earlier. That's why I went ahead and, and streamed. I wasn't actually going to stream right now, but because of that little pump fake earlier, I was working. My stream uh, software was up, and I don't know if I hit a high key or what, but it started streaming. 
So I said, let me go on and jump on. Let me go. I ain't going to be no tease. <laughs> Let's see. Just grinded walleye in the beginning. Pay super well. Yeah. And really, you can manage if you just able to, like, one, manage your inventory well. And if you don't buy a lot of rides or there are different ways to save money on this game where you don't spend as much. Like, if you really plan what you're going to fish and what tackle, what gear you need, and then let's say you only take the rides you need, you'll save a lot more money because repairs, you know, you won't have to worry much about repairs. Um, You'll save money on bait, lure. It's just about mapping it out. But like me, I just take everything. I'm a hoarder, so I just take everything. Cause I like, I might need something. I might need something, you know. I might fish this. I might fish that. But yeah, they as you start to get in the higher levels, you definitely got to know what's the money fish. And once you get to know the money fish or money fishes, you can save up. The best thing to do though, if you just want to like have fun and fish casual, you got to find you a lake, grind a bunch of money, <laughs> and then you can go fish wherever you want for a little while till the money run out. And then you kind of got to go back to grinding again. Oh, yeah, this one running, guys. This might be our uni. God, this thing running. Man, look at that. Look at how this thing is running. I got a reel to try to stop him. Look at how he running. Yo, there we go. Man, he stopped at like three. He could have easily went to four. This ride only got 496. Cause I put, uh, I think I put fluoro on this. I thought it was braid, but I might have put fluoro. Uh, let's see, Grand Wildlife Macro. Do you know why you can't add a feeder on your feeder or bottom rides? Eh, why you can't add a feeder? Let's see, kept the fish shooting and find you twenty five k. Oh, Michael, don't do it. No, no, no. Let's see. Anybody sleep and talk to their girlfriend to help them. Through depression. Um, I mean, sleep helps. Talking to somebody who you know and trust uh, helps. Let's see, level 24. Okay, yeah, man, we can get you up there, man. Get your levels up. Let's see, making it worse when you real. Oh, man, come on. Okay, there we go. Let's see. Do you play Hunter Call of the Wild? Yeah, I do. I have it. I play it sometimes, but I don't play it much because I'm so low level. It be making me mad when I got to sneak all day and, and can't find no animals, can't find no game. But what I'll do, I'll start out and it's like right by a lake and it'll be a bunch of deer right by the lake. And I don't be wanting to, to pop those because I feel like they're too convenient. But yeah, I do play. I do play. Let me see. It was a comment I wanted to read. I got to go back to it, though. Just give me a minute. All right. He coming back. He coming back. There we go. There we go. This one got to be a drum. The one thing I haven't caught yet is a, a a tarpon. I mean, I've caught a tarpon, but I haven't caught like a uni or a trophy. Man, look at this thing go. Look at this thing go. I think the biggest trophy drum, I mean, the biggest uni drum I caught was like 94 pounds. It was 91, and then it went up to like 94. Oh, man. Yo, this one is massive, guys. This might be that tarpon, finally. This might be that 100-pound tarpon. Oh, no. Oh, no. Stop. 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 Oh, he going too far. Stop. Stop. No. Come on back. Come on back. Oh, he getting too close to that 400, y'all. He getting too close to that 400. Come on back, fish. Come on back. Oh, man. Man, I hope he don't spool me. That would be terrible. Uh, Let's see. You know why you can't add feeders on a feeder? There you go. Uh, Feeders on a feeder or bottom ride. 
because it'd be like putting the ride back and forth and then putting it away. That is, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Does anybody know why you can't add a feeder um, on a feeder or bottom ride? I know like with my cart ride, I was having that issue putting the right uh, equipment on it. Let's see, large minnows, hook eight, 30 feet to the right side. Okay. Nah, if I turn the drag up, this uh, one with the line probably going to hit red. I ain't going to even take the chance. I'm going to just wait them out. I'm going to just wait them out. We going to get them in. This a big one, y'all. This a big one. All right, let me know what y'all think this is, too. Is this the, uh, just a drum? Is this like a 99, 98-pound drum, uni? Or is this a tarpon? Did I finally catch a uni tarpon? I hadn't even caught a trophy tarpon here yet. I've only caught the regular ones, but they were big. I caught some really big, like, 50, 60-pound joints. But I hadn't seen that uni that's over 100. Wolf, I'm trying, man. It's hard to see the line because I got this mic right here. So the mic be in the way of the um of the feet, the distance of the line. And that's what I usually look at when I'm seeing if it's pulling me or not, you know? So that's a lot of times why I keep reeling instead of stopping. But I'm going to try to stop as best I can when he pulling, though. You say this is an 80-pound tarpon? Uh, let's see. Your friend was in a 30 minute fight with a 300 pound shark before. Woo. Yeah. Those sharks are crazy. Those sharks are crazy. I caught a 400 pound shark. I couldn't keep him in my net though. He was too big. All right. He coming in guys. I think he coming in. He giving up. He giving up. See, try to walk towards. Yeah. I walk towards. That's about far as I can go. Sub say this is a trophy tarpon. Trophy tarpon, 80 pounds. I think this a hundred pound tarpon. I ain't never had one go this long. Even the drums, they don't go this long. It could be a 90 pound drum. I'm going to say this a hundred pound tarpon though. Let's see. Right now, the fish is on the other side where your boat is. The cart pack is amazing. All right. Carl Callers recommends that cart pack, guys. If you're looking for a good pack. He said that carp pack is a good one. If you're trying to get your bottom feed carp feed fish on. <laughs> Uh-oh. And look, the fish trying to keep us like anticipating. It's trying to keep the mystery up because it's behind the root so we can't see it. Oh, it's a drum. It's a black drum. If anybody said black drum, you'd have been the winner. This a big one, though. This got to be my biggest black drum right here. How big is it? Ooh! Ooh, 100-pound black drum. Ooh, 4,700. Oh, if I had premium, it would be about 7, 8 Gs. At least 6 sale, 4,800 XP. Let's get a picture of that. I don't even care what that other fish is right now. Yo, 100-pound drum. It got the 100-pound drum on it. <laughs> got the 100-pound drum on that thing. Yo, that's a dub right there, Wolf. That's a big dub. That's a big dub. Goodness. That make this little red drum look a little little. Okay, so I'm going to amend my statement about the crab. Crab still catch a bunch of permit. It's kind of like when you at Everglades and you're trying to catch those tarpon. You catch snook all the time. I was going to say I wasn't going to fish with crab no more just because you catch so many permit. But you're going to eventually catch a huge drum with these things. It looked like the drum are attracted to that joint. 
And yeah, I caught on large cut bait, I caught 90 pound black drums, but that 100 pound was on that crab. So I'm, I'm gonna get crab some props. I'm gonna get a crab some props. I'm still finna use all this crab and run it out. And I probably ain't gonna get no more. Maybe get 10 of them or something, just keep them. But just for inventory space too. I'm trying to clean my inventory. But that's good money, good money. Let's see, you get two rides, a beep beep, three ride stand, some licenses. Okay. Let's see. All right. Got to go see your next one. All right, John Luke, take it easy. Take it easy. Appreciate you stopping through. Have a good one. Have a good weekend. Peace. Blessings. Let's see if we can get a tarpon on this one. Hey, does anybody in here know where you can catch the tarpon by the barge? Uh, I believe somebody was saying yesterday about the barge and how you can catch the uni tarpons over there. I went over there because, again, I was level 54 yesterday. I hit level 55 last night. I've been grinding this lake real heavy. And so now that I'm level 55, I was able to get the crab. I got this major popper. This major popper, I was catching tarpon like back to back, but now I ain't been catching them. It went, it went quiet, but I caught like 10 tarpon back to back with this joint. Okay, uh, means he didn't know what you said. <laughs> was hoping for a uni tarpon, yeah. Uh, let's see, 30 feet to my right. Okay. I'm going to try that. Uh, try to look it up on YouTube on where to catch it. Okay. Let's see. You still can't find out the sharks. What? Yeah, you got to. Did you look at the map? Call us. Check in the. um. Man, if I can still go there, I really want to buy another Amazon trip. But, you know, you can only get it once. But look at the map in the uh in the discord channel there's a map in there with like 12 13 spots maybe more shout out the uh wolf shout out the werewolf he put his spots map in there with his markers okay wolf oh my fault you said to the right to the right all right let me go to the right Is this good right here, subs? Oh, you said 30 feet. Well, I'm going to just let it reel all the way in. Uh oh, act like oh, something on that line. Oh, we got two lines going. And what if something hit on this one? I'm going to wait and just see if something hit. I'm going to let it get to 30. There we go, 30. 20 sale. 21. All right, all right, all right, all right. Let's get this one. Oh, we got three lines going. We got three lines going. They hungry. They hungry. All right, we got one. Bam. Oh, yeah. I was going to go to two because I think two was the other one that was going first, but this one acting like he acting like he big. He acting like he big time. Let's see. What's up, Tyler? Come on in, drum. Hey, I like when some of these drum tap out. That's a trophy. Sometimes they just tap out. Oh, that's a uni. We got us another uni, guys. Another uni. You see how quick it didn't even go nowhere? Every now and then, the drum will just tap out. They'll just come right in, and it'll be a trophy or a uni. Let's go on and get us a little picture of that there. Get us a picture of that there for the Discord. Nice, nice, nice. Let's keep that. Let's keep that. Tyler, glad to know I helped, man. A lot with Fishing Planet. Just dropped by to say thank you. Hope all is well. Hope all is well with you. Blessings, man. Uh, really appreciate, you know, appreciate that. Glad I can help. And appreciate you stopping through, man. Hope everything is good with you and your family. Let's see. You looked and you still only caught three. Yeah, the sharks can be a little funny, man. They can be a little difficult. If you go check that stream, though, we did where I went there, 
um, just do what I did. You know, you can either fish with the tackle that comes with that rod they give you and spin fish with swim bait, or you can use blood. Feeder fish with like a 40, 50 pound uh, feeder. No, excuse me, 40, 50 pound match rod and use blood. There we go. Let's see, the tarpons are back at the boat spine. I need large minnows and spine sacks. Okay, the beeping can get irritating. Yeah, it can. Yeah, yeah, I know of uh, BZ Hub. Everything good here, tight lines. Nice. Glad to hear that. Glad to hear that. Let's see, you love to fish and watch others fish too. What's up, can't see me? Hey, look, that used to be the name of my channel. You can't see me. You can't see me, gamer. I had that for some years. We might go try that boat spine, guys, just to switch it up. This one has been good. You say large minnows and spine sacks. I maybe a while ago I hit the leaderboard. Okay, look at this. It's flipping out. It's flipping out. But it's been a minute. It's been a minute. We almost full. Okay, we still in the semi-peak time. True. All right, I'm going to go back. Well, now I'm going to go back. As soon as my net is full, I'm at 700, 925. We catch us a couple more big joints. I'm going to go ahead back to the uh, to the boat spine. I'm going to see if we can catch some. Oh, there we go. We got something right here. Oh, try behind me. Okay. I do that. Let me pull this one in. Look, another permit. I told you, man, them permit, they love this crab. If you're trying to catch some permit, throw crab out. Let's see, 92K every trip, that's profit. Yeah, oh, I've been making good money here. Good money here. All right, I'm going to run back here. All right, subs. Where are you saying I need to throw? I'm going to throw towards this little channel right here, this little canal. I know we can't see it working through the boat, but I'm going to see what it do. We're going to let the poppers pop and the breakers break. Let the poppers pop and the breakers break. Mm. I got a hit. I got a hit. It didn't take it, though. I'm going to cast one more time through the boat. <laughs> the magic boat. Them double engines. Them engines don't play. All right, there we go. I'm going to let this popper walk. We're going to see if we get a hit. Okay, 654-804. Okay, 654-804. 654-804. Six five four eight zero four. All right, let me look at the map. Six five four eight zero four.
Uh, okay, six five four. Okay, so a little further. I'm in the right direction. I just need to throw it a lot further. So down in that canal. Can I park over there? Can I stand up in that area? Oh, man, your cat just fell off the frying pan. Got to keep, keep it cooking. <laughs> That's crazy. All right, I got something back there going. You said no? Oh, man, this one going crazy. These permit, man. Oh, that's right. You said what? Spine sack and. George, what up? What's going on? How goes it? Spine sack and shiners. Okay, bottom ride, float rise. Okay. I'm still going to catch one with my spin ride, though. I'm going to just let you know. I'm going to catch one with my spin. I might go ahead and bring my uh, bring my rides over here then and cast them this way. And I'll throw them out in that direction, see what we get. Okay. I got spine sacks, but I'm out of... um. I'm out of large minnows. I don't like sitting here just holding the ride. I'm going to get the ride stand. I want to spin at the same time. So let me go on and pull these jammies up. Let me go on and pull these jammies up. All right, all right. All right, all right, all right. Going to try this other side. Take us through to the other side. Take us through to the other side. Oh, that's right. Look, I forget. I forget. And I was telling somebody that earlier, just getting the boat. My mind was thinking about how if you switch spots, if you go to another spot and then come back, it'll, uh, you know, to lift your rides up. But I forgot about getting in the boat. All right. All right. All right. Let's see. It's midnight and you still up fishing. Hey, I do that too, callers. What's up, Niz? What's going on? What's going on, Trig? Oh, I only got two crabs left. I'm almost done with these. Nice. Nice. How goes it? Welcome to the stream. Welcome to the stream. Uh, let's see. I do gulf. Oh, you know what? Now I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go ahead and do the spine sack on this one. I do the gulf shrimp on my uh match rides because they won't cast this far. Although they'll probably cast this far. Hey, fishing planet to do that to you, man. It'll have you up fishing. Have you up fishing. Late night. All 
All right, we getting some beeps. We getting some beeps. It was playing a bit. So he just got back from a double birthday party. Nice. That sounds kind of fun, a double birthday party. See, Shiners are good for striped bass. Okay. Are striped bass over here, though? I actually got this other thing. It's not Shiner. It's like Shiner's big brother. I should have went the other way. It's, uh, they're Shiners. Oh, you know what? No, I didn't buy them. I'm going to buy those next. When I run out of these crab, hey, I got some large minnows. I forgot about that. All right, we got a hit. We got a hit. We got a hit. I think I had crab on this one, so this could be a doggone permit. Come on in. What are you? What are you? Identify yourself. Identify yourself. Hot right, look, striped bass. You just talked them up. 20 pound striped bass. All right. All right. Your niece is 18. Dad is 67. Hey, happy birthday. Happy birthday. Uh, tell him I said happy birthday. Congrats on another year. Blessings for another year. And many, many more. I'm going to throw Shiners over here as well. We'll see what it do. We'll see what it do. Let's see. Medium spoon. Okay. Hold on. Let me throw my popper one time. Let me throw my popper one time. I'll put the medium spoon on there. Turkey say you're in your 60s. Your dad is 98. People grow old. Yeah, they do. Yeah, they do. I remember when I was a young whippersnapper not too long ago. The years keep coming and they don't stop coming. Fed to the rules and you hit the ground running. Didn't make sense not to live for fun. Your brain gets smart, but your head gets dumb. <laughs> so much to do, so much to see. For real. So what's wrong with taking the back streets? You never know if you don't go. And you never shine if you don't glow. <laughs> oh, yo, but for real, though, all the young folks, enjoy your youth because the, the pages on the calendar do not stop ripping off, so do not waste it. Let's see. Smash that like button. Appreciate it, Ness. Appreciate it, Ness. Smash that like button. Let's see you 25 now, uh, going to work in America in February. Nice, nice. That's what's up. You know where you're going to be, like what state you're going to be in? Let me try this, uh, this casting spoon. I got some small casting spoon. Oh, I got this one, this glow in the dark, Jamie. Hey, oh, it's nighttime. The nighttime is the right time. Okay, Kansas, Washington. Okay, cool, cool. Is that up near uh, Silicon Valley? You going to be doing something in Silicon Valley? Hey man, and that's what's up, man. Again, enjoy that. I went to uh Redmond, I believe it's Redmond, Washington. I went to the uh when I was still in school, I got invited to Microsoft for an event they were having. It was like this meeting of the minds. They brought all these like smart people, uh, quote unquote, all of these like creative minds, these and these people who had run businesses, young people, like all age groups, and uh, we were brought together to like 
it, again, it was like a meeting of the minds, find solutions for different problems and things of that nature. But it was real cool. I got to tour the facility and see all of these like old things they had in cases. Like it, it was a real dope experience. They paid for me to, and a classmate of mine to go up there for a weekend. Let's see. Okay. It's about 200 miles from Kansas City. Oh, okay. Okay. That's cool, man. Hey, that sounds like a dope experience. How long are you going to be over here? Is it like indefinite or are you just doing it temporarily and then you're going to go back home? Like, what's the game plan? Oh, I see one of the floats moving. Okay, this still peak. Let me try this buzz bait. Nine months. Man, that's cool, man. Just to be able to, you know, leave, leave your country, go somewhere else and, you know, whether it's work-related, school-related, man, that's, like, really dope to be able to do that. Hope you enjoy that experience. All right, we got another white striped. Well, striped, not white striped, striped. I need to mark that, but I ran out of markers, man. I've been and I don't want to spend up my bait coins. I like to buy the uh you spend the 17 bait coins and get the 33. I don't like buying them individually, but I need to mark that. See, yeah, you did it when you was 22. Want to go again? Money is good there. Nice. Yeah, I had thought about doing some similar things uh, when I was a little younger. Traveling, hitting some other countries and things of that nature for work. And I still may do some of that. I still may do some of that. All right, guys, let me get a lake check. What lake y'all fishing? What lake are y'all fishing? Where y'all at? Or what game are you playing if you're not on Fishing Planet? Let me know. Let me know. <laughs> no tax. <laughs> I hear you. Can't see me. Say so you've been watching my vids on Car Mechanic Simulator. You love them. Hey, that's what's up. That is what's up. Glad that you are enjoying them. I actually got to do some more CS uh, uh, Car Mechanic vids. I need to do a stream. I might do a stream tonight or tomorrow, like tomorrow morning. I might get up and do a little stream. I hadn't streamed it. I really hadn't played it in a minute. I wanted to do some more vids. I had some like tip viz lined up but they changed some things with an update man they nerfed some of the uh things that work all right turkey and emerald dallas you on 2k park that's what's up wolf you still fishing in california okay emerald lake hey dallas what system you on Oh, something finna hit. Ah, take it. Take it. I hate when they just nibble at it and then they, they let it go. Go on and get it. <laughs> so you standing where I'm at. Are you getting any hits, though? I'm not getting many hits, man. I'm a, I'm at the move back to the other spot. I want to fill this net up. They being a little stingy. Okay, Xbox One. All right, you're going to get a PS5 soon, though. Man, if you get a PS5, let me know where you get it. Hook me up with your connection because I need me a PS5. And I am not trying to spend no $1,500. All right, 
I definitely the donations that had to be rolling in to do that. Mostly snook. Okay. Well, we got another hit here. It's something small. It might be another striped bass. Look like I'm really only getting striped bass right now. Oh, you might have called it. This is snook. Yeah. Got us another snook. Let me throw it over here. Let's see if we get anything in this area. Move it in a bit. Uh, is that the plane? Have y'all seen the plane taking off for you guys that are uh, at this lake? It'd be real cool when that plane take off. See if we get this thing to pop. There we go. Hey, come on, pop, pop. Ah, I had a hit. Oh, my real speed was up a little faster than I intended, but that's all right. Let's see. You got some money from your aunt's will. Oh, man. Sorry to hear about your aunt, man. My condolences. Sending my condolences, my prayers, man. Oh, oh, we got a hit on something. Oh, we got a hit on something. What is it? Is that another snook? Bass. Do you like bass? What is it? Oh, we got a unique comment snook off the major popper. Hey, nice, nice, nice. Uh, nice, nice, nice. Let's see what's this. What do we have here? Uh, Okay, now the way this one's swimming, he kind of swimming at the top, getting this shark on. When you see them sharking like that, that might be a trophy. It might be another snook. Okay, that's a drum. That's a drum. All right. I'm going to go over this way towards the canal. They look like they over here towards the canal. And see if I can make something happen again with this popper. Pop, pop. Pop, pop. Mmm. Mm, they hitting right there. They hitting right there and they sitting right there. Okay. This one want to fight. This one want to fight. Now, that last uni schnook didn't fight this much. So this may actually be something else. Unless it's a bigger uni schnook. It actually might be. Can we get two unis like that? Okay, that's a trophy. That one was fighting more than his cousin. Let's see. Wish you could share fishing gear and stuff. Yeah, I know. I know. Eris, what's up? Just got the fish and in real life. Nice, nice. What were you fishing? Where were you fishing? What was you fishing? What would you catch? Black drum. Oh! Oh, look at that flounder. Oh, look like a monster movie or something. <laughs> we got us a trophy. Trophy Southern flounder over here. Nice. I do want to mark that. Man, flounder is some ugly fish. That's an ugly fish. I can't believe I be eating that. I love flounder. Ah, nice. Saltwater trophies. Hey, 21,000. Five bait coins. Yes, yeah, sir. Yes, yeah, sir. Way to finish it out. Way to finish it out. Let's see. Do I got one? Okay, I got one. I want to mark that flounder just because. Just because. Uh, all right. Ah, I missed them. I waited too long. Doggone it. Doggone it. 
Let's see, you just got the fish. Okay, caught a striper bass. Nice, nice. Uh, you can't buy the DLC and premium shop and gift it to a friend. Uh, there's a lot of them. Yeah, the only game I know that, only fishing game I know where you can actually gift gear is uh, Russian Fishing 4. And one of the, per the person sending the gear has to have premium. Unless they done changed it, because I ain't played it in like two years, two, three years. So unless they took that away, you used to be able to gift gear to people. I had people like send me reels and rides and things of that nature. Uh, I used to make some content for it. And I actually liked it. It's a very realistic game, but the devs just got greedy. They got real greedy, and they would nerfed everything, and all your gear would wear out all fast. It's like, man, I had to stop playing it. That's when I came to uh, Fishing Planet. Let's see if we can catch us another one. Look like the schnook sitting right there. All right, there we go, there we go. Uh, let's see, a lot of them. <laughs> well, not for long, man. You ain't going to be broke for long because you're going to be coming to the States. You're going to be working soon, so it's a temporary thing. <laughs> right. Yeah, I did. I'm almost full, guys. My net is almost full. Oh, oh, another hit. Another hit. Yep, look, these schnook are sitting right here. And they loving this popper. They loving this popper. Bam, okay, 11 pounds. I need to catch me another 100-pound uh, drum. But you guys just getting in here and hit that like button. Hit that like button if you ain't hit that like button, man. Feed that algorithm. But uh, early, I caught a hundred pound drum, hundred pound drum. That thing was massive, and it was fighting like crazy. I thought it was gonna be a tarpon, but it was a drum. Well, well, well. Yeah, they is feeling this popper. All right, y'all. Come on, come on. After I fill this net, I got 20 more pounds to go. And then I'm going to go to the next day. And I'm going to go respawn at the boat spot. Respawn at that boat spot. Uh, respawn at the boat spot. Hey. Oh, this might be it right here. Might be it right here. Actually, this one don't seem like it's that big. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Let's see. He got a little weight to him. It's another snook. Okay, that's a drum. It's a drummer boy. Okay, that put us over. That's it. That's it. That's it. Good, good, good. Good, good, good. I'm going to hop in the boat. We're going to pull these nets up, pull these lines up. Let's go ahead to the next day. 33. Not bad. Not bad. Let's see what I done made. I got two six. Okay. Not too bad. Let me spawn right here. Yeah, this is where I got to come to catch these Crab Island exploration joints. The Shiner, the Warmouth. All those there. I'm going to have to fast forward my time. Chase, what's up? What's up? What's going on, Chase? How goes it? All right, Wolf, where am I supposed to cast? Where do I cast for this unique tarpon? 
straight ahead to the tree, to the left with these trees, to the right in the open area towards the barge, at the branches sticking out. Look in the map. How do I look in the map? Let me see how much I got for markers. Do I got 17? Cast in the middle of the water. Oh, in the deep hole. Got you. I'm going to cast right here. Let me see my face. Okay, look like over that way. Look like it could be good to go walk to that other side, but I'm not. Oh, it's kind of right there. All right, all right. How do you buy premium? Just go to premium. Just go up here to premium. And then buy whatever you want. If you're talking about premium account, it's these. 360, 180, 37. You click on one of these. All right, I know you said uh, spawn sack and one other thing. I think large cut bait. I'm not a large cut bait, so I'm going to use the spawn sack. So I can put my ride stand down, though. Go right here by this tree. Large minnows. Oh, you know what I do? I still got some large minnows. All right. We going to large minnow it out. Right, I got one crab left. Oh, you know what? You know what? Hold on, though. Let me fast forward because this ain't peak time. Let me go to peak time. Nah, Fishing Planet is not cross-platform. It is not cross-platform. You can, if you got an Xbox account, play on the PC, though, but you'll still be using your Xbox account. Uh, let me fast forward. I'm going to go to buy here. You know what? I'm going to go there. That way it won't be as long for his nighttime. There we go. I'm going to throw a spine sack right here beside this tree. Bam. And then I'm going I'm to throw this crab out. I just want to get rid of this thing. And you know what? Nah, that's all right. We'll, we'll come back to that. Let me see. Large minnows. Throw this large minnow in the same area. And see if this is like the Everglades where the schnook be eating everything up when you're trying to catch the tarpon. And let's go to my feeder. Okay, we got spine sack on that feeder. I saw some little fish jumping up this way. So, oh, I see one of the floats going. I see one of the floats going. We put that one there. Ah, doggone it. And four, five. I'm going to go with spine sack again. I'm going to kind of put it in between all these fish jumping. There we go. There we go. Throw this popper out, see if I get anything while I'm over here. I got to go back this way. That's where all the channels at. Hey, look at my crib. Yo, this nice. We got a grill. We might need to throw something on the grill. That was a cookout. I got the lime mold. All that. Let me see if I can catch anything with this popper.
it might not cast far enough, so I don't know. Hey, so you caught a trophy tarpon. Nice. Are you still back at the previous spot or did you move? Did the Panthers win? Yes, the Panthers did win, Chase. We 3 and 0. We 3 and 0, baby. 3 and 0. Yes, sir. But Christian McCaffrey got hurt. He pulled his uh hamstring, so he's gonna be out like at least four weeks, at least three to four weeks. And we lost um the DB we drafted. Top 10 draft pick. Joe Horn, or his, he ain't Joe Horn. His daddy was Joe Horn. If you remember Joe Horn, who used to play for the Saints back in the day. Um, the guy that pulled out a cell phone and got fined and flagged, he pulled out a cell phone as he scored a touchdown at receiver. We drafted his son at defensive back. He a big time defensive back, and he got hurt. He, gonna, he broke his foot. He going to be out all season. We lost two of our top players, or, you know, two key players. Let me put it like that. McCaffrey, our, our number one player, and then the young uh, prospect with a ton of potential. Let's see. You watch the video full of the tarpons like to hide in deeper waters on the boat spine on the left and right side. Cast the rod to the left side of the deep hole and two on the right side. All right, yeah, I tried to move them around a bit. One of them actually started moving like he was getting a hit. Oh, that one went way out there. All right, look, that one moving, so it got a hit already. It has a hit already. We're going to see what it does. See how far I can cast this. It moved, but it stopped. I'm going to get these a couple minutes, and if they don't do nothing, I'm going to wrap it up. Yeah, I'm sitting here waiting to get a hit. <laughs> I did get a little quiet there. 
Uh, I'm trying to see if anything comes through. Thanks, can't see me. Take it easy. Have a good one. Have a good one. Have a good weekend. Yeah, I'm trying to wait on this ride. I see out here moving, but it might not make it. There it is. You see that? All right, come on. Take it. Take it. Let's see. You got three tarpons. Look east. There's a big dead tree in the water. That one right there. What type of bait were you using? Oh, look, it hit like right there on the tree too. Like the distance is perfect. The distance is perfect. Let's see. And we'll move this one. Skull, what up, what up? What's going on? How it goes it? Yeah, I'm here, at Blue Crab, man. Here, at Blue Crab. What's going on with you today? Oh, I got to start getting up. I caught a 100-pound drum earlier. That thing was crazy. All right, guys. It ain't looking like they hitting for me right now. I might either have to wait till the till the peak peak hit, or until um maybe another day. I'm gonna sit here. I'm gonna keep fishing here and try it, and I'll let y'all know in the next one. But yeah, I'm gonna wrap it up. I'm gonna wrap it up. I still got a few more things to do, guys. Let's see you right beside Mississippi Wolf. That's what's up. Guy in your lobby, back to back uni tarpons. Dang. My fat belly just got back from a Mexican restaurant. Nice. That's what's up. Yeah, I need to go eat me something too. Oh, Chase is 7.30 here. It's 7.30. Yeah, man. So it don't look like they hitting for me right here, but I'm going to keep testing this out and mark me some spots. We'll see what we get, guys. But look, man, I'm going to wrap it up. Again, make sure you check me out on uh, the plan stream. The schedule stream is tomorrow, so I'll be on tomorrow as well. I might do an early one. I'm thinking about streaming some car mechanic or something else for you guys that watch that. Or just come on through if you ain't doing that and you see that notification. Otherwise, it'll probably be in the evening um, around this time. It'll be a little later, you know, maybe like an hour from now after everything gets settled, guys. But, yeah, man, it's been a good one, man. It's been a good one. I appreciate everybody for coming through and hanging out with me, man. Again, we will do it again. Hit that like button for me before you get out of here. Hit that like button. Sub if you're not sub. Follow. Do all that good stuff, guys. Yeah, man. And um, if I don't see you, hope you have a great weekend, great Sunday to finish out the week. And uh, hope you have a great start to your week, man. Peace, blessings, good health for you and your family. And, yeah, I'm going to get on up out of here, guys. Sparky, what up, what up? What's going on? Yeah, man. So, yes, again, make sure you hit me up. Oh, shout out to my members. Shout out to my Patreons. Shout out to everybody who supports in Super Chat. 
Uh, shout out to all the elite fam for just showing that love and support, and man, in general, man, thank you all for all that y'all do. Shout out to my mice. Thank you guys for helping keep things running smoothly, man. So yeah, I will holler at y'all tomorrow. Holler at you on the later on. Peace and blessings, and y'all have a good one, man. Charles Macro, I'm out. Peace.